unpacking idioms, travel in packs, explained. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating idiom, travel in packs. This phrase is not only interesting but also widely used in English conversations. So, let's unravel its meaning and usage together. The phrase, travel in packs, originates from the animal kingdom, where it describes how certain animals, like wolves or lions, move together in groups. In English, this idiom is used metaphorically to describe people who often move or act in groups rather than individually. It implies a sense of unity, strength in numbers, or sometimes conformity within a group. Now, let's see travel in packs in action through some examples. 1. Teenagers often travel in packs, especially in social settings like malls or parties. 2. In the corporate world, you might notice that some colleagues travel in packs during lunch breaks or meetings. These examples show how the phrase can be applied in various social contexts, highlighting group behavior. Interestingly, travel in packs can have different connotations based on cultural contexts. In some cases, it might imply security and camaraderie, while in others, it could suggest peer pressure or lack of individuality. Variations of this idiom include phrases like move in packs, or go in packs. When using this idiom, consider the context and the message you want to convey. It's a versatile phrase but remember, it's always about groups, not individuals. Use it to describe collective behavior, social dynamics, or even as a light-hearted observation in conversations. And that's a wrap on travel in packs. I hope this video has shed light on this intriguing idiom, making your English conversations richer and more colorful. Remember, language is not just about words, but the stories they tell. Keep exploring and see you in our next video.